Hello everyone, welcome back to my After Effects tutorial channel. This is Randy from Rand's Graphics and today let's learn how to create a clean folding page video slideshow inside After Effects like this. Let me start by creating a new composition and I will name it main one. Nineteen twenty by ten eighty p thirty frames per second and the duration probably is eight seconds. Click OK and again I will go to composition and create a new composition. I will name it video placeholder one. Nineteen twenty by ten eighty p thirty frames per second and eight seconds duration. Click OK. I will go again to composition one more time. Create a new composition and I will name it text placeholder one. This time I will change this width to 700 and the height is 150. Click OK to zoom it in. Grab the text tool and type Beach Paradise. And I will be using Master Break 72 pixels for one size. I will align it horizontally and vertically. Then I will grab the pixel again and type tropical. This time I'm gonna be using Metropolis Light. And the size of the font probably 14. Press P on my keyboard for the position. Move it. Then I will open video placeholder one. Open my folder assets, expand this footage, and I will first use this five feet, drag it into my timeline, and I will open the main one composition and drag the placeholder one on my timeline and the text placeholder one. I will press P on my keyboard on the placeholder one for the position and drag it up. I just wanted to put into the right corner of my image. Go to effects and preset perspective drop shadow. I will change the distance to about 10 and the softness to about 5. Go here and open the title action safe. Grab your shape tool, create a mask like this. I will duplicate this video placeholder one. Go to edit and duplicate it. I will click M for the mask to show up and delete this mask. Grab my shape tool and create a new mask like this. If you saw a gap like this, just go to the mask expansion. Make it one. Also highlight this video placeholder one below and click M. Expand the mask. and make the value here one so as you can see now here the gap is gone so we will close this one highlight again the video placeholder one above we will just change it to cyan so it's easy to identify and then i will highlight both the placeholder one click r on my keyboard for the rotation move my playhead to about two seconds and i will create a keyframe on the y rotation move my playhead at the beginning of my timeline and change the value in here the cyan video placeholder one i will change it to 70 degrees placeholder below i will change it to negative 70 and parent the text placeholder one to the video placeholder one cyan go to layer create a camera i'm using two node 35mm preset camera go back to layer and create an all object I want this null object a 3D layer. Parent the camera on the null object. Press P on your keyboard for the position. Shift S and Shift R for the rotation and for the scale. Move your playhead to about 2 seconds or so. Create a keyframe on the Z rotation by hitting the stopwatch here and for the scale. Move your playhead back to the beginning of your timeline and change the scale here to probably 60 
and the Z rotation probably negative 25 and change the Z position to about 120 move your playhead to about 3 seconds and change the Z position to 0 so now we will highlight all the keyframes and press F9 to easy is it now I will go back to my project panel create a new folder and I will name it scene 1 I will highlight these compositions and put it on my scene 1 folder including the main one and then I will again create a new folder and I will name it scene 2 I will open the scene 1 folder Highlight all the compositions, go to edit, duplicate it, drag it down to my scene 2 folder. Close the scene 1 and open the scene 2, highlight all the compositions and double click your mouse to open it up. You don't use the placeholder one so delete it. I will highlight the beach paradise and double click my mouse to change the text. I will change it to wonder bridge. I am still using the master break font. make it 60 pixels to make it smaller i will change the tropical text to to london i'm still using the same font the metropolis light and i will drag it down and move it a bit on the right side i will open the placeholder too and delete this video clip and change it to this image drag it down to my timeline and open the main delete this null object and this camera because we don't use it anymore press your keyboard out and hold it highlight the placeholder one change it to placeholder 2 then highlight the video placeholder 1 and change it to video placeholder 2 change also the video placeholder 1 above and change it to placeholder 2 highlight the placeholder 2 press P on your keyboard for the position and drag it on the upper left corner of your image I think that should be good enough I will highlight the video placeholder 2 press M to show the mask highlight it delete it and grab your shape tool and create a mask And also highlight this below video placeholder 2 click M for the mask to show up and highlight it delete it grab your shape tool again and create a mask parent this text placeholder to the video placeholder 2 color cyan and then click R for the rotation and delete these keyframes here and go my playhead to about 3 seconds duration create a keyframe by hitting this stopwatch button and go to 2 seconds duration and I will change this to 180 degrees I will parent this placeholder to the below video placeholder 2 and then press R on the keyboard for my placeholder 2 below and delete these keyframes create a keyframe on the X rotation drag my playhead to the beginning and make sure that this anchor point will be at the bottom so I will just click this one here and I will change the X rotation to 90 degrees so now when we play it So if you can see this one, all you have to do is to open the mask options and probably expand the mask to about one. If you see this one here, all you have to do is to go back to video placeholder 2 
click out for the rotation and change here to about 110 there you go it's gone so all we have to do is to try to play it and also we'll go back to the text placeholder too highlight it and change the active camera to top and just move it a bit closer to the image like that and let's see what happens all you have to do is to go back to active camera and again we will try to play it there we go so i will go back to project panel and create a new folder and i will name it scene 3 i will highlight these compositions go to edit and duplicate it i will drop it down to the scene 3 folder and double click my mouse to open it up because i'm not using these compositions i will just delete it So first I will just change the text here, double click the wonder bridge, change this to amazing nature. And then I will change this London to gods. Move it up a bit. I want this amazing nature to be aligned horizontally and vertically. I will go to placeholder 3 and delete this video clip drag these mountains on my timeline open my main three compositions click and hold alt highlight the text placeholder 2 and replace it with your text placeholder 3 highlight the video placeholder 2 replace it with the video placeholder 3 it seems that i have a wrong spelling with my placeholder i'll just correct it it has been replaced so now I will highlight this placeholder and click M to see the mask and highlight it and delete it. This placeholder 3 below, I will click M and highlight this mask and delete it. I will go back to video 3. So grab your shape tool to create a mask. And also this one here, grab your shape tool and create a mask like this. Change the mask expansion to 1. And also this video placeholder 3 color cyan go to mask expansion and change it to 1 close both highlight it again and click R for the rotation just delete these keyframes go to video placeholder 3 cyan and create a keyframe on the Y rotation go to 2 seconds duration change this to negative 180 degrees and make sure that this video placeholder tree up will be parented to the video placeholder below okay and also make sure that placeholder tree below the anchor point must be on this side i'll just click here so that the anchor point will be on this side go to video placeholder three below and highlight this y rotation and move your playhead at the beginning of your timeline and change the value here to about negative 70 and highlight all these keyframes press f9 to erase it let's see what happens so now we'll go to composition create a new composition and i will name it final i will change the width to 1920 and the height is 1080p I'll just change the duration here to about 20 seconds and I will click OK. So now I will drop down the main 3 and the main 2 and also the main 1. I will just put the main 1 at the bottom. Next is the main 2. I will probably highlight this main 2 compositions. Move this layer to 2 seconds. Click open bracket key. I will move my playhead to about 7 seconds. Open bracket key. So when we play this one,
So guys, our tutorial has been done and I hope that you learn and enjoy our tutorial for today. And for those people who are new in this channel, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share and even press the notification bell so that you will be notified in all the videos that I'm gonna be uploading. So my thoughts for today guys is that do good things to other people not because of who they are or what they do in return but because of who you are okay thank you for watching and see you next time god bless